right, folks, the deck is Reno Blood Death Knight. The goal of the deck, honestly, I just haven't played Vampiric Blood in a while, and this felt like a good excuse to do so. If you're watching this on YouTube, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. You can catch me live at twitch.tv slash raffle. Watch this! The Scarlet Crusade will see to your destruction. You will know pain. All right, uh, let's keep a cadaver. Look for... Just to go with it. That's, I guess, okay to forage on two. Allows me to use my mana. Ooh, it is very bad for me not to have a way to kill that. Good recognition from the opponent, though, that, like, I'm not likely to have a way to kill it. Fortunately, the result is likely that it runs away with the game. Unless I hit Arcanite Reaper off the top here. Nope, I am dead. Guess we don't necessarily know what type of priest it is yet. It could be Reno Priest. Well, they overdraw now, so clearly that's a good thing for me, right? That they have ten cards in hand to my four, five. Clearly that's a good thing. Everyone knows that. This one card just uh, is on its way to single-handedly winning the game right now. It's three less. I have to kill it here. As much as I would have loved the other cards. That one card has uh, devastated me enough already. does look like it could be a Reno... Dragon deck. Okay, well, we, we've got a curve. If it is Reno, that's probably a better matchup than, like, the... I don't know. Zarimi Bursty deck. Maintain our lead on board. Seems to be the main advantage we have now. The Marut could do some stuff. In fact, did do some stuff. The time potential. A world cleansed of it's pretty bold to do when I had a tail and die and could easily have hit the. Yes. <laughs> like I think, in a lot of circumstances, that is a. For 50% of the time, that could be a game-losing play. What we can do instead is just hold for the Reno. Wow, these are maybe some of the worst possible five drops you could expect from this. They're all three threes. Those are three mana cards, not five mana cards. Told you. <laughs> Let's go Mermy again for some more. We'll pretend like this matters. Basically just Mermy for corpses. My hand can hold no more. So the reason for this play is they need to like play cards, right? Or not. 
but I want them to commit more resources into the Reno, is what we're trying to set up for here. It's possible we get Zarimi as a result. That would be unfortunate, but. My rage is not bound by size. Doesn't look like that's happening, at least. So they have indeed fallen into my trap. This is exactly what we set up for, because, again, they needed cards out of hand, so it was pretty predictable. It's also entirely possible that they just, like, you know, Uno reverse card and hit me with the same game plan. That's bad. Um, corpse explosion, asphyxiate, reds. A strike, that's fine. What you see. I think we can bump Hero Power Face, play the Banshee and the Vampiric Blood. So, slight fatigue advantage for the opponent at the moment, but we do have, like, the recursion from the Zilliax. As long as we don't do something silly. Um, yeah, good answer. As long as we don't do something silly, like, play it into a Reno. Could be good on the no muncher. Let's go ahead and forge this. Even though we don't need to get to get the spell. I do have Fizzle's snapshot, which should give them a lot of or at least some late game value. But me getting the Reno down first is a pretty big deal. Okay, Zarimi remains in hand. protocol. I do have the capacity to get another soul stealer off of the ETC. Need help. Let's give you some extra time. There's also a corpse explosion in there and a vampiric blood that could uh, be to my benefit. If I need like a quick response to this board. But like the second Zarimi and the third Zarimi don't really do anything. Need help. Let's give you some extra time. Okay. What shot is all I need? The citadel stands strong. Can you feel the gift of the sun? Another 
It's a decent test for their Reno. Predictable. Can just go here, ping face. Efficient here. That feels good. What's left as a threat? Maybe a yog? Probably a yog. the asphyxiate in hand. Yet. Mm, no wear and tear of any kind. Shifting gears, I'm playing for the late game. Rain that they don't have the same Zilliax as us. Still do have a Primus and a Hematurge to maybe get some more value. I bring life. Uh, that here power is a little bit spooky with potentially Raza. Maybe something I should have considered. But I don't think Raza is run in most Reno decks because uh, he's a little clunky and they like already don't have him down at least. At least heals me for four, not more. yourself. So we just ping and play the Zilliax here. That's pretty phenomenal. Very, very, very good card to generate in that spot. Especially with such a small deck, we're about to get head very quickly. That's very bad for me, though. Finally drew the asphyxiate. Unfortunately, my entire the entirety of my game plan was just neutralized by that Duffin. So that's a shame. Great harvest, 
Unreal. Need help. Let's give you some extra time. I can't on though. Where did they go? Holy. Let's go here for a 10 mana weapon. Wind Fury, deal six. That is uh, a weapon that represents lethal here. But that Resco was incredible. <laughs> oh, what a sweet animation. I don't often see this used against, like, a wide board state. Primus last card, by the way. Did they gen- this is the second one, right? Doesn't matter, lethal is happening here. Starlight well, okay. Oh yeah. either be hand buff or just like the flood paladin just in case it's the flood deck i think i probably want both one drops under more, most circumstances i'd probably pitch one of them back probably the armor vendor we don't want to go for a greedy keep in this matchup And coin a three if I have the opportunity because like I've got two threes and that's a muscle man. If I had to guess. But it does make it likely to be the hand buff paladin, which is probably worse for me. But we are at least presently ahead on board. So, there are worse situations to be in in this particular matchup. And we do have things like Harp's Explosion, Soul Stealer to help. Probably just looking to play the Talon on curve. I don't know if I'm going to be super eager to play the Rune of Darkness because I want to keep the Corpse Explosion ready to go. Obviously, I do get a lot of corpses. Oh. Okay. That's a little surprising. This is not what we stood for. In a good way. Not terribly upset about this. It'll be fun, at least. Another mutt? No, that can't be. Okay. I wonder if they know they don't need to forge in order to get a spell. Think we can just play this big fellow on curve here. And we play the Marat. They do be excavating. Oh, 
Okie doke. Do I have elementals in deck? I sure don't. We are a tad bit behind at the moment. But these matchups tend to be a bit back and forth, so that doesn't necessarily mean that we lose the game yet. The desert sun strengthens my rage. Break it, you buy it. The loss will be more. Yeah, let's fix their positioning you. mistake for them. Might as well. Wind Fury. Eight drops. Fantastic. Job done. Next turn might need to be the uh, corpse explosion. At least the four first corpse explosion, depending on how much they develop. Third, excavate. What did the chickens ever do to you, buddy? So what is the point of second attack? 21 damage coming at me. This leaves me really susceptible to Reno. Death calls. It's a good pickup for the corpse explosion. Oh, that's a good pickup as well. Have the big boy in hand. Which to me at least suggests that I don't want to give up the soul stealer. Not yet. I do have a backup soul stealer here as well as a backup corpse explosion if I want it. Not sure which one I'll want. Sun strengthens my rays. But we definitely are going to want this soul stealer here. Got so much value off of that on curve mirage. That's pretty, pretty devastating. Just for that, like repetitive value. Outside, you step into the domain of <laughs> Wouldn't mind picking up a Reno at some point. Shouldn't be terribly difficult from here. Uh, is this the time though? Probably. Well, looking for a standoff? Careful, oh, me. 
My hand is full. Just because it makes it most likely that I'm able to get down a weapon. Honk. That's an issue. I'm gonna. Whoa. That's gonna make life trouble some for me. Uh, that might have changed the outcome of this game. So I'm just gonna try and go aggressive here. Oh no. Uh oh. The issue with this is that it like meters out their resources in a way that I won't be able to uh, to match with like this into a soul steal or even this into corpse explosion, which is what I'm hoping to do here. Yeah. It's a devastating uh, response. That's like the worst Tyrion has ever been. <laughs> Right side, we technically have the potential to just like get there with weapon damage. No, we don't. Good lord. God, that's such an unbelievable amount of damage. I don't like this, but I think I have to. I think I'm just getting... Like, outvalued right now. Once again, the Primus refuses to... show up when I need him. This can get me a third copy of... Uh, Soul Stealer, at least. It's not terribly meaningful. It wasn't. The toy store to the title. Right, what's in the box? My blood for the Lich King. That's pretty good. Stand and fight in darkest night. Another soul. All right, this is another chance at a corpse explosion. I still think we're behind, just because, like, the... Can you feel the gift of the sun? How did a burrow buster generate that? Just because of the size of their minions from the... Um... Forge this because I will need the healing. And play this. I've been concerned about playing this because of the Reno, but I feel like reasonable expectation is that if they had the Reno, they would have played it by now. It's entirely possible that. You have a fraction of my power. Okay. Right. We knew that they had that. Good God. Well, we're going to need a miracle off of this. Or that. The runes decide your fate. Ah, remnants of life.
It's something. They can use this uh, on my minion, but... Man. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> There's almost no way back into this unless Yogg does something silly here, which, fingers crossed. Okay, they're playing around that to the best of their ability at least. Destroy the board. That's <laughs> not at all what we needed. Alright, this has to have a corpse explosion in it. Unholy symbol of death. We Does this get us? No, there's n not even close, right? Unless this has an equality in it. Can you feel the gift of the sun? Uh it does not. Silence, Paladin. Well, it was a fun game until the opponent, uh... Oh, dear. Did someone sound a horn? Went on an emote frenzy. It was still a fun game. In spite of the opponent, rather than because of it.